Well, a number of hikers have descended to Lesotho as the Mushweshwe walk has kicked off today. The annual event is special as the Mountain Kingdom marks 200 years of existence. Lesotho Prime Minister Sam Madigani is also taking part in the 116-kilometer walk. Now, SABC News reporter Kaili Sheikh Humalo has more on that story for us. A very remarkable day here in Lesotho. So many hikers here really are here to commemorate what is bound to be a very interesting uh, couple of uh, three days here in Lesotho. As you know, that uh, it's a very important walk. Uh, 200 years for, you know, just Basotho existing as a nation. But let, let's hear now from uh, the founder of this particular walk, uh, Mr. Tabo. So once again, sir, thank you so much indeed for your time. Uh, by all means, I mean, quite a very significant occasion. Tell us about the importance uh, of today. Okay, the importance of today, uh, as you remember where we are standing right now, it's where Kim Mushashu was born in 1786. Then he went to Buta Buta after he got married in 1820. Then from there, when he was at Buta Buta, then he moved to, to Tababusibu. Then we are doing that journey from Mengkwanin to Tababusibu because that's where the formation of the Basotu in 1824 started. So the whole idea for us to come here, we are celebrating 200 years by centenary. That's the whole idea we are here. It is really a magnificent event that we want to take it to another level. And you can see people from all over the world, Chinese, Europe, everybody in Africa and the South Africans, everybody is here. So. Mm, and I mean, Lesotho is quite important to South Africa. I mean, this is, uh, it knows no other neighbor other than South Africa. And in the very dark days, uh, fighting against apartheid, Lesotho opened the doors for so many freedom fighters to come and, and, and be based here. I would imagine that by all accounts, I mean, so many South Africans are also seeing the importance of today. You know, this is the neighbor and uh, quite a very historic moment. Yes, of course, you are right. When you said uh, Lesotho, to harbor the some of the ANC members we are running away from South Africa during the apartheid era but the most important part that is we are the heart of South Africa it's so unfortunately with that opportunity we are still landlocked but again when you want to go to South Africa you still have to produce your passport second important issue anything that happens if your passport is is uh, damaged for example if you stay there long so then they damage your passport you will stay in south africa you'll never go to south africa for five years and imagine you can't go anywhere in the world you can't even uh, transit in south africa so as you said it is a very important thing because the very same people that are ruling that's the people that we have in Lesotho. Real as Basotho, Brenda Mushet said to us, anybody that comes to Lesotho, he's part of us. You remember Mushet, have Zulus, Kozas, every tribe is here in Lesotho. So it is a very key important issue. We in South Africa, we are one thing. It's unfortunately that we can't cross the border. Then there's these borders that came with the British when during the, 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 the 18th century. So I think that, that's where the problem is. But the most important part today, we are together as South Africans, all people from all over the world, we are here. We are taking those ideologies from Kim Mushasha the first forward. It is a very key important issue. Before I let you go, Mr. Tabo, uh, who can we expect in terms of uh, the high profile guest during the course of today? Okay, the Queen is here, the Prime Minister, the Deputy Prime Minister, the Ministers are here, uh, the diplomats are here, and the European Union Ambassador is here, German Ambassador is here, and the British High Commission Ambassador is here. All of them, they're here. So everybody's here, the diplomats and other high profile people from UN are here.